open to Eve Singularity, a major freak, and today I'm going to deal with uh, skill extracting on Singularity. So, <laughs> I guarantee you there's nothing. Right. <laughs> Cleaned out completely, but have no fear. What we do is, how much plex do I have? Okay, I don't have anything right now. Plex. Oh, I don't know how much plex do you think I want. Give me all of it. No, I want to get more, more, more. <laughs> oh, I can easily afford that. <laughs> Oh, it's in my Plex Vault already? Hey, thanks. Alright. Is it? Excellent. It is wonderful. <laughs> now, the cool thing about this, this will persist through mirrors, too. It's, yeah, it's pretty funny. But, uh, yeah, I, you don't, <laughs> I don't think you have to worry about it persisting. <laughs> Sounds great. We'll actually tell you what. Just because we're feeling really nice and want to contribute to CCP's virtual singularity store. I'll just hell, let's freaking go for broke, right? <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! training pretty sure anyways doesn't matter all right so that's a all right bye bye science skills Sure, spent a, a lot of crap. Amazing. I could do this on tranquility, but I'm kind of a pack rat. I'm like, I uh, most of these skills now I'm just um, using for database research. Data, they're the research a research agents. They're they're nothing to do with blueprints. <laughs> yeah. They're one of the stupidest passive income sources um, the game's ever invented. And ever will invent, I think. Alright, so that's done. Have fun with that. Oh, hell, why not? And drain all of it. Too bad you just couldn't go science. <laughs> uh, anchoring, yeah, like. When the hell do I need that at the level 4? anymore, right? Nope. 
advanced target man. I don't need that many targets on single journey. There you go. Done. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, subsystem structure management. Targeting trade. I definitely don't need that. I definitely don't need that. Yeah, whatever. Uh, targeting. Ooh, sexy. Drain that sucker. Woo. -hoo. Radar sensor compensation. Wah ha ha No. Okay, signature lab analysis. Fucker. Yeah, whenever it's like grayed out, if you need it for something else, it's like a requirement. It'll actually list it. Do, 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 do. I know. I know documentation. I know. Uh, nope, not gonna touch that. Social. Bye-bye connections. See you later. And I'm just going to town, aren't I? Alright. Do, do, do. Let's see what else is good to drain on tranquility? Uh, nope. Nope, definitely not. Uh, not ready. Scanning on this character? No, my other character's got definitely decent stuff, so. Jump portal, oh. Alright, whatever, I'll take that. And I'll take that. And. Do, 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 do. Ooh, survey. Cool. Go away, survey. Definitely want to experiment with that because I want to figure out what kind of use the planetology stuff is at various levels. To you know, will it increase your extraction? Will it increase something else? Who freaking knows, right? Why can't I? What do you? It doesn't really matter, does it? All I'm interested in in this stuff. So, yeah. Um, nope. And uh, you know. You know. You know. Um, nope. 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 Ooh, I could probably... What do you think? Do I have something silly like... I could do light fighters. Loop. There you go. Done. Alright. <laughs> it's ten. Nice. How much is that going to give us? Yummy. Alright, baby. Let's check this out. How much do we get? So I've got about one... About one and a half months, so... How much did you get me? It got me... Fifteen... Twenty-four, 
No, 36 days. So, what's that? Yeah, brains. Brains still not working. Whatever, 36 days. Over a month. Gave me five weeks. Woohoo. Is that going to be enough? Do I need... Now let's chill on that. Let's move that down here. Crank that puppy up that way. There we go. Optimal range. And I'm not going to try to go for the, uh... <laughs> where, where is it? The Moraton... <laughs> it's like a billion-esque at least on the... <laughs> on Tranquility. It's at least... <laughs> not... Yeah. <laughs> well... Uh, why not, right? Splurge for that. <laughs> I've got to self destruct some more jump freighters. Right. So, what will this get us in damage? It's going to be interesting. How much damage can I do? Once I get all that stuff. Uh, I don't need you, I don't care about you. So, good. So, let's see now. I have... an Edencom ship somewhere. I, there it is. Somewhere fit. Okay, so... I have damage of currently. And the Vorton projector will allow me to fire the tech too, so yay me. So currently my damage is uh about twenty one two seven. that and let's do this okay and of course let's find type unfit, unfit. And that was the consortium of course Blur. what am I missing can I totally screw up in this skill? Oh, right. Derp. I need guidance? Really? Oh, I totally screwed up on that, didn't I? Oh, I'll rip. I'll use a uh, skill attack on somebody else then. <laughs> um. for a dollar. Yep. Blah, blah, blah. Shut up. Come on. 
get in there. There you go. skill that helps. There you go. Alright. Oh, we're just gonna have to sit on that and Major don't know. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give sure I've got enough skill. Sure, I do. <laughs> Begin the rape and pillage. <laughs> Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, can I do it when my um, skill training? Cool. Alright, science. Oh, ha, ha. Bye. Accounting. Bye. Okay, bye, accounting skills. What? You scumbag. Events count. Events broker. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, ultimately, I'd like to see if I would have enough DPS increase um, to account for um, how can I adjust how many uh, Edencom ships I use uh, to simulate um, um, a couple of more. Um, we're trying. We're trying to. Uh, somebody said, some troll said you could use two Edencom ships to annihilate um, tornadoes, uh, gag tornadoes. And I went on Singularity and, and trounced that idea. Um, but just to be fair, you know, I mean, the the idea is in my head to absolutely nail that coffin shot. Is to, uh, yeah, is to get max skill Eden Com ship and a pair of them or a simulated pair of them um, and shoot up some uh, gank tornadoes and see what happens yeah somebody foolishly said uh, if you if you're gonna shoot somebody's idea down, you better bring good data. I'm like, so you're allowing somebody to troll everybody with brainless ideas? Yeah, I, I quit that alliance that day. I was like, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. He took thirty seconds to think that up, and I'm gonna have to spend how many hours figuring this shit out to actually. You know, voice my opinion. That it's an idiot idea. Yeah, okay. Let me get it right on that. You know, may, it might take me a while. Oh, no, I'm too short. <laughs> Whatever will I do? Yeah, whatever. It's not like I use this thing for much. 
I'm surprised I even have decent skills in this character. It's just a hauler. <laughs> Killed manager. Ooh, check that shit out. Nice. Alright, I think that should be enough. What do you think? Do, 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 do. Huzzah! What? Only that much? I want more. There we go. That's blowing my skirt up. Hell yeah. Yes. Eve is not for pants. No pants game. Alright. Uh, I type and... I'm... <laughs> I'll, I'll try both of them. Um, and mess with flux. Nope. Screw you, buddy. I got tech two now. I'm in the big leagues. Necto punch, strike snipe. So, what are we looking at here? Oh, that's not bad. So that is. Let's get out my handy dang calculator here. I hate the in game calculator. Alright, so. Uh, 215.3 um, divided by 127.7. So you got a 70% increase. Um, so I would need. Let's do the math here. Uh, if there was two very high skilled Edencom ships, I would need. Yeah, that's what I was using. I was using three. It didn't work. So, yeah. No, he was like, yeah, you can just use two Edencom ships, blap them out of the sky. And it's like, yeah, that'll take you about 50 seconds to kill stationary, non-tethered tornadoes that are sitting there like idiots taking your fire. Yeah, that's really going to work well for you. <laughs> and if you want to go closer, I mean, if he, if he really thought that you could get within 50 clicks of tornadoes and not have them warp off, yeah, kid, give me a dead either or. It's just the idea of flip, just loitering on a high sec war deck grid with bling pinatas? You gotta be kidding me. Against pirates? High sec pirates? That's gonna get you a perma deck forever so they can milk you, you whale. Jesus. <laughs> okay, so theoretically. So it took me, what, let's say 50 seconds. That's, that's almost exactly what I, what I did. So 50 seconds to kill um, the tornadoes. And I've got four or five, so... Um, <laughs> what do we got here? Uh -oh. I got yelled at by my wife. that weren't jumping around like jackrabbits on speed um, which he's want to do the target war target is um, so <laughs> so that's double the amount of time so that would be 25 seconds to kill all of his tornadoes 
how fast do you think he's gonna warp if you don't point him? You know? I mean, how fast do you think he's gonna warp his stuff? And how many points do you think are gonna land, right? So. Yeah, I mean, you could put points in this, but you need to be closer, right? Yeah, it's just. All sorts of stupid doing this. Yeah, you'd be so dead. Yeah, 25 seconds. That's a long time on a battlefield. There's no way you're going to be able to do it. And he'll just get you pointed. And he'll warp back with Megatrons. And you're toast. Yeah, that's, that's... Against his Megatrons? Yeah, good luck, buddy. Yeah, let's, let's be realistic here. You think, ooh, it'll work in 25 seconds. No, it won't. What do you... Do, do, are you naive? But yeah, um... 25 seconds. So that's, it's not going to be able to blap you in seconds. The tornadoes. They're paper thin. But it's not going to do it. Okay? It, you'll need sustained... You'll need to keep them on field and kill them. It would work. But why are you flying ships that only do, you know, I mean, sure, you'll get all of them at once, yay you, but the amount of effort getting them pointed and kept on field by ships that are doing less DPS, I mean, you got to think. You're going to kill, say, five of them with two ships, and you need somebody to point them, so... Yeah, it's just... The, the, the theory crafting, the strategy... I mean, the tactics are... You're fine, you're only at 25 seconds to kill them, but it's like... The strategy of it is like... A, it's not gonna work. And B, he warps his tornadoes around like jackrabbits on speed until he's got a good target, or he sits there tethered. He only uses them in defense, so he's mostly going to be tethered or docked up at NPCs or elsewhere safe. What are you thinking? Yeah, it's just the, the lack of thought that goes into the strategy of it is like, did you, did you, did you take this beyond brain fart? No, he didn't. So, yeah. 25 seconds. What was he imagining? You could just blap them off the field in seconds? A few seconds? What goes through his brain? Uh, okay, so you have four. Four of these. Jesus, that gives me chills thinking about that much bling on the field. But say you had four of them, right? So you half the time to kill them. That's 12 seconds. Um, pretty sure if you were able to do that in 12 seconds. And he was not doing anything but sitting there staring slack jawed at you. He's gonna be back. <laughs> and he's gonna catch you at a gate if you try to get away. Try to dock up, go, go for it. But what are you gonna do? You're war deck. What are you gonna log off and try to sneak out once the war deck once the war is over? <laughs> okay. So next war deck. He's going to be waiting for you. <laughs> and he's... Yeah, sure, you killed... Let's see. Uh, disposable income for him. Uh, a petty change. And next war deck. I guarantee you he's going to war deck you again. If you get to take out his upwell, which I doubt with this kind of mentality. He's going to war deck you forever. And ever, and ever, and just milk you, you stupid whale. <laughs> it's like, what, what are you thinking? What's, what's going through your brain? It's like, here's the thing about any PvP in EVE. You don't go, oh, neat little trick, we'll get him. It's like, no, 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 don't do that. You strategize by going, what's the next step after that? You go... Oh, he, uh, just assume that any fit you do will be known by the enemy eventually. And whatever you do, repeatedly, will be known to the enemy eventually. Right? So if you 
loiter around on anywhere with this blame piñata at war deck as a doctrine I have good luck yeah it's just all about what happens after what happens once they get wise to you that you must when you theorycraft I have to like about like for example that um that Hugan fit it's like You know, what's the chance of somebody finding out by hearsay or watching the video or hearing about the video or mostly it's probably going to be hearsay within friends, you know, friends talk to friends and word gets around and all of a sudden some ganker finds out you're flying around with this ridiculous amount of bling. That's not quite... Go away, you stupid thing. Not quite fully plated. It's only got a 400, so you know, I mean, a billion? Yeah, you throw a few tornadoes against that one. Pop. <laughs> and it wouldn't be hard. So yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. I was like, yeah, this is a great fit, and I can afford it right now because I'm making so many billions, but what am I thinking? You know, it's like, think about the next step. Think about your vulnerabilities to people who get wise to it. And then, can that can you survive that? Have you accounted for that? And if you can, then you go great. It's a perfect fit. Let's go with it. And that's what I did with you. And I dumbed it down a bit, so it's not so blingy. And I go, okay, that's survivable in PvP. There's no PvP. We, uh, um, you got to tank against PvP. So you gotta go. All right, I've, I've got my hull, my shield, and my armor accounted for the for my tank I'm gonna go for armor tank um, what about my PvP tank do I have a weakness in my PV is there a resistance hole in my PvP <laughs> that's basically what this is this is a huge resistance hole in your PvP because <laughs> people are just gonna drool and that's you don't want that if you're if you're a care bearing alliance you don't want PvPers to drool over you it's just a really really bad thing to do <laughs> yeah.